Christina Farley, and I am the author of the Gilded series. Today, I have a special treat for you. I have asked some of the top YA authors in the industry to share with you their writing tips on how to become a successful writer. Hi, my name is Karen Akins, and I'm the author of Loop and its sequel Twists, their time travel stories. And I wanted to share a little revision tip with you today. Um, one thing that I do after I've uh, finished a story and taken a little break from it is that I will print it out in a different font. And there's something about being able to touch it and write on it with different colored pens and use post-it notes that really helps for me um, to give me a fresh perspective and uh, to literally just look at my story differently um, because it looks different. So anyway, I hope that's a help to you. Hi, it's Maureen McGowan, author of The Dust Chronicles. Deviance, Compliance, and most recently, Glory. My biggest piece of advice for aspiring authors is to learn to accept and grow from constructive criticism. You're going to face it in your career no matter what, so the sooner you get good at accepting it, the better. Good luck with your writing! Hi, I'm Lori M. Lee, the author of Gates of Thread and Stone and The Infinite. And I want to show you what your greatest learning tool is when it comes to writing. Not Kingdom Hearts or Not Walls. Books! Books were my best teacher as a kid. They taught me everything from basic grammar and spelling to characterization and how to plot a novel. If you're reading a scene that was particularly striking, slow down, take it apart, and see if you can figure out how the author was able to create such an effective scene. Once you know how to do that, you can take that skill and apply it to your own writing. So that's my writing tip, and I hope it was helpful. Hi, my name is Mary Crockett, and I'm the co-author of Dream Boy, which I wrote with my friend Madeline Rosenberg. So what's my advice about writing? I think it's most important to make writing fun because it really is fun and sometimes you can lose that when you when you try a big project it can be, seem too important or too intimidating or too overwhelming but if you focus on what you really enjoy about it and what's fun about it for you then you'll keep writing and maybe you'll end up with a book. You just did my writing advice and that is to seek out the experts in your writing field and soak up the knowledge that they have to give to you. I hope you have a great day guys. Bye!